going on y'all hope y'all are having a great day uh, today I'm gonna show you behind the scenes of a YouTube golfer day in the life uh, it's my off day this week and obviously as you can probably tell uh, right now I have 600 subscribers this isn't my full-time job maybe one day it will be but right now it's just a hobby uh, I've, I enjoy filming the videos that the editing it the editing is a grind but uh, we're up on the way to Barefoot Resort, the Fazio course, filming the 13th episode of Every Course in Myrtle Beach. Uh, showed you some scenes this morning. I woke up at 5.30, had some breakfast, packed the car, did some stretching. Uh, and we're on the way at 6.20, left the house. We got a 7.15 tee time. And uh, I believe we're uh, going to be the first one out on a single tee course. Now, there's only couple courses here in the area that are single single tee so we should be able to fly around in about three hours normally takes me about three hours to film one of these videos if I'm not waiting but uh, I'm excited it's a good course my last uh, few rounds I've been spraying it a little off the tee so hopefully we'll get that under control today but then uh, after we finish that up we're gonna head home grab some lunch do a workout in we got a, a back day today I've been alternating every other day between a, a high intensity interval training workout, about 30 minutes to do those on uh, from YouTube, and then and then hit my garage gym uh, full body split. Uh, I go basically chest, back, legs, shoulders, try and buys, rotate there, hit each group, uh, hit each muscle group real hard. Might not be ideal for golf, but that's what I like to do. Um, so we're gonna do that. And then we'll charge up our phone and camera, give it a quick charge, and probably gonna head to the range this afternoon, uh, work on a few things and, and film another video. I have one in mind. Maybe I'll see that in the as the next video posted. But uh, yeah, I'm just gonna show you guys kind of what I do. Today's my off day this week, so no major responsibilities. Don't have to go to work or uh, watch my daughter. So basically, I'm stay at home for you guys that don't know i'm a stay at home dad three days a week watch my daughter 18 month old daughter and then the other two days sometimes not you know sometimes it's on the weekends but tuesday and thursdays are um you know if i'm not working then it's a good day for me to go play golf so today I wasn't scheduled to work and uh we're gonna get this film in so i'll show you guys a couple scenes here from barefoot and thanks for tuning in What's up, y'all? We are back for episode 12, Every Course in Myrtle Beach. Today, we're at Barefoot Resort, the Fazio Course. You know it's bad when you're talking about good progress and you're still in the trees over here, the tree lines. So this is how I film my videos. This is a Nikon d3500 it's really a photography camera i didn't buy it my mother-in-law is letting me borrow that but i use that to pretty much capture all the shots um occasionally i put my phone because i can plug in a microphone to my phone when i'm putting unfortunately this can't putt it's just really a photography camera uh maybe one day maybe soon i'm hoping to get a uh, video camera but right now that's uh this is how we're filming our videos out here on the course 8:45. We're nine holes down of filming uh, at Barefoot on our uh, 13th episode. Every course in Myrtle Beach. Having a little snack here at the term, peanut butter and jelly that we packed this morning. Um, just chilling out for a minute. Looks like up on the next green there was a bunch of mowers, guys raking stuff. So I'm sure we're gonna catch them. We're just chilling out for a minute. No big rush. No one right behind us. But this is how we do here. Good rebound, come on now. Best drive of the day, probably. All right, guys, filming done for the morning. It's 10.45, took about 
three hours, 15, 20 minutes, a little bit longer than normal. They had like six holes, cart path only, but uh, it was a good time. I, I struggled on the back, but yeah, that's golf. It happens. We're heading home now. We're going to get some lunch in us, let that digest for a few minutes. And while we're uh, letting that digest, we're going to a little bit of editing from a previous video that we filmed uh, last week I believe and then uh, and then hit a hard back day and then uh, see what's next after that we made it back to the house we're gonna make a, a beef taco with some rice and a couple of strawberries we're gonna crush that down and uh, like I was saying do a little bit of editing so let me show y'all what this final lunch looks like. There's our lunch. Time to dig in. That's pretty good. Watching the uh, Brian Bros match that I started this morning, watch like 10 minutes of it while I was drinking my coffee. They have a great channel, man. But I'm gonna finish this lunch and we'll catch up with you in a minute. <laughs> Woo, that was delicious, but kind of a lot. So I'm um, gonna give that about 30, 45 minutes to digest. In the meantime, I'm gonna uh, Catch a little bit more of this match. I'm going to uh, get the dishes in the dishwasher, get a load of laundry going, and then it'll be, uh, it'll be gym time. Not only do I enjoy watching a lot of YouTube golf, I also use it as an opportunity to study what they're doing, how they're filming, how they're acting, see if I can uh, you know, get a few pointers here and there. It's time to make the long commute to the gym. Let's go. We made it. So we got all our lifts wrote down and planned out. Uh, and then also the last two uh, workouts, we got the, the weights and reps listed. So we're going to try to do more uh, this week. So we're going to try to maybe like 11 or 12 pull-ups or, or an extra set here. We're just trying to do a little bit, eat, a little bit more each week. All right, workout is complete. That was a good one, feels good, nice back pump. Now I'm gonna go take a second shower of the day, quick shower, and a Epsom, Epsom salt bath, big bath guy. Won't really show you any of that, but I will show you uh, a little bit of editing uh, to round out the end of the video here. We're gonna get in a little bit of editing before uh, the wife and daughter get home. Shotgun starting golf is full of mathematics and um, there's a lot of, a lot of setup work that we have to do in order to make a tournament work. 
I'm spending a few minutes here replying to the comments I got on a previous video. All right, guys, we just finished up with a glorious bath and, um, you know, nice podcast. Uh, shotgun start while we were doing that, feeling, feeling good here. And, um, yeah, so let's show you a little bit of how I edit all right now on the iPad. No iMac. I'm planning maybe to get an iMac and like I was talking about earlier, a video camera. So showed you uh, the photography camera. It's decent quality, I think. And this is the mothership of our operation, really. It's a SD card. I got this little adapter um, stick, little lightning adapter. I'm not sure exactly what it's called, but um, it goes in into the iPad and uh, go to the photo app and, and it pretty pretty easily transferable, transferable takes like five minutes. So uh, I've already done that. We're working on episode 12 right now, not the one we filmed today. We, we usually stay backlogged by a week or two. So working on that, um, we use the Golf Tracer app for all our tracers. And uh, as you, you might be, I think you can see this here. Uh, we don't have much on the iPad, really. I got <clears throat> iMovie, using iMovie right now, YouTube and Golf Tracer, and I have to delete everything, delete all my files after after we finish a video, and has to really even delete the Golf Tracer and YouTube, and, and I use Adobe uh, Express as well a little bit for the thumbnails and a, and a couple other things, but I have to delete everything after I... Uh, when I'm ready to export a video because it doesn't have a whole lot of storage on this thing So we're definitely thinking about and saving up for uh, for a Mac um, But yeah, iMovie. Let me show you a little bit of that here But first I'm gonna do a shot tracer. I use the golf tracer app This is what takes the longest amount of time in my videos. All right, that looked good there So then we hit finish the top right corner. It's gonna take 10 15 seconds so as you can see that, I don't know exactly, that probably took like four, three, four, five minutes just to do one tracer. So I know when I first started, I was even slower. I didn't know the adjust and go back and forth. I would have to restart the whole thing. I think the first video I ever made took me like 15 hours. If I had to guess, I can do a nine hole video um, with Google Earth how I do the Myrtle Beach series with some bells and whistles, like four hours maybe. Um, I'm gonna find out, like I was saying a minute ago, I think I'm gonna find out pretty soon exactly how long. All right, so once that finishes uh, loading in the tracer, it, it just exports straight to my camera roll. So I'll go back here to iMovie, go to Albums, Recents, it'll be my most recent one. I hit the add button, adds it to the timeline. So one more thing on how I make these videos, I'll show you real quick. Um, forget exactly how I made these. You can watch a YouTube video, but I put this flag in. I think it was like a JPEG background or something, transparent background. It, it wasn't real hard to figure out, but I saved this flag with a transparent background. Go to iMovie and you know, go on part of the clip I want. And instead of adding a new one, I go to picture in picture, extend it out, make it smaller, and then put it right where you can see the flag here. What makes it a lot better, you can see that one's a little too low, but you can see exactly where the flag is. A nice little touch, I think. That's pretty much one hole. Would that take like 10, 12 minutes? I don't know. So it uh, definitely takes some work on these videos. And, you know, if you're thinking about making them, maybe you don't. Maybe you just watch me instead. Well, that will about do it for the video, guys. Uh, it's, what is it? 345. I'm going to edit a little bit more here. I probably got like 30, 45 minutes till uh, my wife and daughter get home and then. I'm really going to cut off. No more messing around with YouTube. Uh, I've spent some time with them. We're, we're watching Ozark right now. We'll watch some of that, hang out with uh, Stella, our daughter, make some dinner, and, uh, do, you know, family time. So uh, we're going to cut the video off here. Uh, appreciate y'all watching the uh, YouTube Golfer Day in the Life. Let me know what you think. 
If you don't mind, drop a thumbs up on the video, subscribe if you hadn't, and we will see y'all in another video soon. Peace.